It's getting hot as summer quickly approaches and we want to avoid heat related tragedies. This year there have been 11 hot car deaths so far in the U.S., including five here in Texas. Bethan Sarkeesian spoke with officials who want to avoid any more like these from happening. She joins us live with more. Jacqueline. Amanda, a recent study came out that shows Texas leads the nation with the highest number of child deaths. In the past 27 years, 118 children have died here in the Lone Star State. Do something, because the worst thing a parent can do is to think that's not going to happen to them, because um, that's how it happens. Since 1998, 712 children left in vehicles have died of heat stroke in the country, and all of those deaths could have been prevented. That's why for the past seven years, Austin Travis County EMS has been teaching a baby safety class. There have been no heat related deaths like this here in the Austin area recently, but that doesn't mean it can't happen. Captain Randy Shabra says all it takes is a split second for a child to be left behind in a car and become overheated. Just last week, Week in Texas, two toddlers died after they were inside a hot car for 15 hours. Shabra believes taking a safety class now while school is out is key. Safety class for anyone who takes care of infants. So it's a class where we focus on the main issues that we see within our community, preventable issues that are causing injury or death to our children, um, like child passenger safety or car seats, water safety, um, home safety, and things like hyperthermia or kids in and around cars. And that class is for any expected parents, caregivers, grandparents, or just anyone who takes care of children on a daily basis. It starts tonight at 530 at St. David's Hospital in Round Rock. Registration is required. The class is expected to last about three hours. Officials say another helpful tip for parents or, again, anyone who takes care of young children is to have a plan in place that involves a child. This should be something in your daily routine. Jacqueline Sarkeesian in Central Austin. Jacqueline, thank you.